The Terminal Classic USTC repeg is finally here. Let's break down what's happening and what the future might look like for USTC. Of course, we gotta start with the USTC price charts. You can see over the past 24 hours, we're down about 3% on USTC. You might be thinking, well, that's not a good thing. Why is that happening right now? Well, this is where we need to zoom out and get a wider picture. We can see, well, wait a second. When we zoom out and look at a wider picture, USTC peaked up almost 75% just the other day. And right now we're still up roughly 40% in just two days. So while we are seeing a pullback right now, we are still up dramatically over the past couple days from close to that two and a half cent level. Right now we're at about three and a half cents for USTC. You might be wondering, why is the value of USDC pumping so much compared to what it was a couple days ago? Well, the repake proposal submitted six days ago currently has over 70% support. And based on this, even if all the people who have not voted yet vote no, this proposal will still set to pass. And that's going to happen in one day. And so a lot of people are excited thinking, well, USTC, the repeg is going to start tomorrow, but we need to talk about something really important. It's important to understand that this is a signaling proposal. This is not going to immediately start the plan of a repeg that we have to look for the further deadline. The deadline for that has been given for May 27th, 2024, just over a year out from now. And that is the time that's going to take to collaborate with different exchanges, the developers, work on the code and do a bunch of these different hurdles that need to be accomplished. And so while there's a lot of excitement right now in the Terra Luna Classic community, it's important to understand that this is not going to happen for a while. Now, we might be able to actually get code changes and start implementing things sooner than the May 27th, 2024 date, but this is not something that's going to start tomorrow. If you're getting value in this video, I'd really appreciate it if you'd consider hitting the notification bell down below so you don't miss another video just like this. Now, Zardar has actually commented on this repake proposal. Someone was asking about it the other day, and he responded and said that he needs to talk with Duncan about it. He thinks that they can make it work, though, which is really important. Important. They just need to make some adjustments and potentially significant adjustments to the L1 platform to make it stable, secure. Zardar continues by saying he's only read over it at a glance, and there's some technicals that need fixing, but overall the idea is not bad and somewhat matches what they've been talking about previously in TR. And so tomorrow we might see the value of USTC go up again as people get excited. We could hit again back up at these highs, roughly another 20% up from here. But I think the more likely scenario is that we see it pull back a decent amount as people realize, wait a second, this proposal is not going to immediately take effect. We're not immediately going to start the repeg. This is signaling that we start the process. We start investigating it and looking into it further. And so it's really important to be aware of this because right now we're looking at highs that we haven't seen since the end of October. So multiple month high we're over a three month high and right now we're sitting in somewhat uncharted waters where we could either explode up or we could drop back down so make sure to be careful do your research if you want to learn more about the potential of terry little classic check out this video up here and i'll catch you on the next one